The Teledyne Floorpack Bot is a rugged, lightweight, all-weather unmanned ground vehicle UGV, intended for the bomb disposal slash counter IED role. The system has seen acceptance into service with the likes of the United States Marine Corps, USMC, the Italian military, and, more recently, an order placed by the German Army. Beyond its given ordnance disposal role, this unique system can also tackle battlefield reconnaissance and related search and surveillance tasks that go beyond the military sector, this includes hazmat control, police SWAT support, and engineering reviews in the civilian sector, such as its inherent versatility. Packbot has already proven itself a viable companion for the modern warfighter, particularly in relatively recent actions with American forces in both the Afghanistan and Iraq theaters of war and paves the way for a new generation of battlefield robots to come in the near future. The heart of the Packbot is its three-link articulated manipulator arm that extends up to two meters in any direction to safely disrupt difficult-to-access objects such as improvised explosive devices, IEDs, various types of unexploded military ordnance, and buried landmines among other incendiary devices up to 30 pounds in weight. A small arm manipulator, SAM, is also offered with a rated 15 pounds weightlifting limit. The gripper hand can rotate 360 degrees and handle objects the size of baseballs and the user operates the packbot safely via remotely through a two-hand ergonomic controller, modeled after a game console's gamepad. This controller sports security key encryption to keep out unwanted users. An optional wire spooler located at the rear of the packbot chassis manages the controlled release of the optional communications fiber cable to ensure tangle-free operation when in the field and operating the unit at range. The operator also has access to the Packbot facilities by way of a laptop-type interface system with integrated keyboard. The chassis is propelled via a track and wheel arrangement fitted to either side of the chassis. A positional, triangular-shaped track extension assembly is fitted to the front of the chassis to assist Packbot in managing higher ground which, in turn, allows the robot to traverse uneven terrain including staircases, rocky surfaces, loose gravel, and mud. Grade traversal is rated at 60 degrees. The chassis features an onboard computer powered by a modern PC processor integrating handling and behavioral sensors into the mix via the iRobot Aware 2 modular intelligence software suite. Sensors keep track of where the grapple arm is at all times to help eliminate the possibility of accidental collision with nearby structures. The computer is installed with a self-monitoring overheating protection system as well as integrated GPS, compass, and inclinometer. User-assisted vision is handled by a vision and targeting camera that features 312x zoom and laser range finding as well as day-slash-night-slash-low-light vision capability. The camera system can tilt upwards, downwards, rearwards, and forwards and two cameras can also be mounted to the manipulator arm for enhanced situational awareness. Packbot utilizes a gas detection meter for the purpose of detecting and identifying hazardous nuclear, biological, and chemical NBC, sources. The nimble little unit can reach maximum speeds of up to 5.8 miles per hour on flat, prepared surfaces, sports an overall height of just 7 inches, a width of 16 inches, and a length of 27 inches with all features stowed. As a whole, Packbot weighs in at 24 pounds sans its battery pack. Power is supplied by way of 2XBB2590-U lithium-ion rechargeable batteries that give the Packbot up to 4 hours of operation on a single charge equal to approximately 10 miles of road travel. Packbots are issued with a spare battery pack for obvious reasons as well as a battery charger. Teledyne Floor Packbot marketing material boasts a product with up to 75 available optional accessories for the base model 510. The model 525 is a more modern, more enhanced offering from Teledyne Floor, seeing upgrades to camera equipment and broaden mission capabilities. It retains the highly mobile-slash-transportable qualities of the earlier mark.